what are the institutions and things they can do that keep protect the most secrecy? Oh, you want that's the BIS, no right. doubt about it. Right. The D the BIS is headquartered in Basel, Switzerland. The BIS headquarters agreement with Switzerland specifies that, that, that Switzerland can't arrest anybody, can't prosecute anybody, right. can't access data, can't issue subpoenas, can't trespass. I mean, the BIS, for all intents and purposes, it's is above a the country. Law. Right. It's a country operating inside of another country. Right. It's, it's above the law. Ultimately, they're going to they're going to go for the passports, but I don't think they're going to go to go for passports before authorizing legislation, because that makes it kind of. I don't know. Obvious. Well, they're trying to they're trying to get it now all over the place. Right. I think now now the what's going on now to me is with get people ejected and you know mandatory vaccines and all that. That's really to me the value in that for the powers that be isn't the control so much as it is the precedent. It's it sets the precedent for what they can do later. I think that I think the order goes you set the precedent you get the authorizing legislation, you spring the trap with the passports. Right. Then you got them. Right. The I think that's the order. The passports are the trap. Yes. Once Once you've got people in the passport <laughs> system. Right. And that's what people don't understand. That this It's a pincer movement. The passports, think of the passports as a critical ingredient of the CBDC system. Right? Right. Yes. But they're like the CBDC credit card or something. Think of it that way. And and you've got to have the passports to make the CBDC system go in terms of implementation and politics. Right. And so I see them as literally one thing, and that's why I wanted I wanted sort of this publication of the of the passport. You know, sort of trying to look at the passports, trying to look at the CBC, so we can figure out sort of how this is going to come together in the trap, and and. And to me, they're two parts of the same system. And it's not clear to me that if you're sitting in Jerome Powell's chair, you know exactly how it's going to come together. I don't think they do know. So we're looking at at something which is ultimately driven by physical force and very centralized physical force. But there's no doubt a lot of it plays through the finances. And at some point, physical force doesn't work because people get their back up once they right. can feel it, see it. And that's why you want to have the passports and CBDCs and have everybody in lockdown before, again, they see the trap. Yeah. Okay. But the, but the trap, I don't know, to, to me, the trap is the passport. Yes. That's I, it. I completely agree. Once yeah. it's what, it's what Naomi Wolf said, the passports is the end of human liberty in the West. Thank you.